Hey HighTechLegion.com, this is Skate and Eric here today to show you one of the offerings from Zygmatech. This is the Pantheon case. Uh, this case, the name was derived from the building in Rome. Uh, the term Pantheon means to every god, and it was a temple built in Rome that basically honors all of their gods. And it's known for its impressive structuring, which basically it translates to this case as well. It, there's a, this for the price. This is a very, very impressive case. Now the first thing that I'll show you here is the front end of the case, which is very black um, and completely mesh grilled. Uh, there is three five and a quarter bays, an optional three and a half bay here, and then uh, this giant mesh grill on the front here, which you will notice, uh, which makes this case pretty special, is this is removable. And all it does is a little clip on the bop bottom that pops up, and what you will see here is it is a front-loaded front loaded hard drive base here. Now, um, these are just tension caddies that hook in here, and basically this the top two are hot swappable bays while uh, the bottom three are just generic now transitioning to the side here what we see is there's a nice gigantic window that is cut in an X type shape for uh, the Zygmatech brand uh, another unconventional thing that we see here though is we have the two intake fans here uh, over the hard drive bays on the side instead of the front there and the side is just held in with generic thumb screws that come off by hand. And then we have the removable panel. Now a closer look at the top bays here will show a tool free design. Um, you just push the drive in, line it up, and this simply just twists in and out. And then uh, all these wires hanging here is for the fan controller. They already have the three fans uh, pre-plugged in there, and there is optional for three more. Now taking a look on the back end motherboard tray here, we do have uh, mesh grill bottom, bottom mount PSU. There are nice little rubber grommets here that will uh, prevent vibration and hold the PSU securely in place. Uh, we have cable routing holes here with the protected rubber sheathing in there and a nice large motherboard tray cutout for uh, heat sink swaps. For the back end expansion bays there is also thumb screws used as well uh, for a more tool free design and we have the uh, uh, liquid cooling uh, hose routing holes right here as well. There's four with the rubber grommets in place. The back end here just gives a better look at the hose holes here, the bottom mount PSU hole, the motherboard I.O. plate. On the opposite side here we can see the better look at the CPU tray cutout and the cable routing holes. Now I took apart the wires and pre inserted them through here because they were just all dangling out of the front there. Um, there is a nice, if you can see, they protruded, or intruded, whatever you want to call it, the, the tray a bit inwards to leave clearance for cable spacing, which is, I think, very nice. Uh, some are flush with it, or they just have barely enough room to fit you know the smaller cables and not the thicker cables like the motherboard cables so I think that's very nice for spacing and then on the opposite side here we also have to keep make sure there's complete security with those drive bays uh, you can tool free lock them on both ends and then as we take a look on the top here what we get is uh, the two fan controller knobs right here. They're just twisty knobs that go from low to high. We have our uh, eSATA port, two USB 2.0 ports, our USB 3.0 port, uh, power button right here, reset button, and then the, the LED, uh, 
the fans inside are white LEDs, so this is the toggle button for the internal fans. Uh, this mesh back here is completely removable. This is uh, made for liquid cooling radiator setups. Uh, what I had done is I had actually pulled the USB 3.0 cable through the top here instead of having it ride over the motherboard there. So that's why I have the cable hiding here. And that is the Pantheon from Zygmatech. A very uh, impressive design and very affordable case for any gamer or pretty much any computer user.